This is the first video we're making to demonstrate our cyclone device that turns a paint pail into a dust collection vessel. The way that the device works is airflow comes in through this inlet duct, swirls around inside the paint pail, and then exits through the second duct. The device fits onto the single uh, connection of a paint pail and simply tightens down with the nut that uh, fits the threads of the paint pail lid. And once we have a pail, we'll rotate it into the correct position and fully tighten the, the lid down. So I've installed the lids on each of the paint pails. The cyclones have to be rotated such the duct on the inside touches the wall. So I've rotated to the right and you tighten the nut. And I'll do the same, same with this one. Rotate it to the right and it's just touching and close the nut. In addition to that, we've hooked up the hoses. It goes from tail number one will be the first one. We'll put another hose on here to go for the, the hand wand. And pail number two. Um, so pail number one will be the one, the container that picks up most of the material. Container number two will pick up any residual material and give us an indication of how well cyclone number one is, has been working. And from there it goes into trusty vacuum, which I'll tilt my camera down so you can see it's just sitting below it just a standard rigid home shop vac or wet dry vac in this portion of the video we're going to demonstrate how uh, plaster type material is vacuumed and collected into um, the cyclone we have a second cyclone to see how much material is bypassed and gets collected in the subsequent device During the break we managed to uh, unlatch the lid and I'm just going to open the lid and set it aside here. And we're going to look inside and we'll zoom out so you can see. So it's a couple inches down. And on the other side, on the one side, maybe uh, three inches down and uh, probably about one inch down on the inlet side. So a good portion of the painter is filled with material. And now we're going to take the lid off the secondary container. So taking the lid off, you can see there's some material on the lid. I'm looking down in the container. There's some material, you can see a small amount of material in it. And this would be representative of the amount of material that would land in your shop vac. Thanks for watching our video on our new cyclone. For more information, visit our site at www.mymfgco.com.